Hello, second grade Smarties, and welcome to Foundations Unit 10, Week 1, Day 1. This week, we are going to be learning about a new syllable type. We're going to be talking about double vowel syllables, or we like to think of these double vowels as vowel teams. Remember, when two vowels are next to each other, there's a little saying, when two vowels go walk in, the first does the talking. So when we see two vowels next to each other, Either the first vowel is going to say its name or those two vowels are going to make a new sound together. So this week we are going to practice with a I and a Y. So for our drill practice, we're gonna start by looking at these two vowel teams. Here we go. A, I, bait, A. A, Y, play, A. And let's move on to our short vowel sounds and some consonants. A, apple, a. Ah. E, ed, e. Eh. I, itch, i. Eh. O, octopus, a. Ah. U, up, a. Ah. B, bat, b. D, dog, d. P, pan, p. Q, u, queen, qua. Very nice, Smarties. And let's do our R control vowels. A, R, car, R. O, R, horn, or. E, R, her, er. I R bird er. You are burn er. Kiss your brain, Smarties. Very nice. All right, so we are going to be learning about a new syllable type. We're going to be talking about double vowel syllables. So that is when we see two vowels next to each other making a new sound. Sometimes it's going to be a long vowel sound or sometimes it's going to be a new sound. So I'm going to build the word bait. So b. A. Bait. In the word bait, it is one syllable and it is a double vowel syllable because it has that vowel team a i. So we would tap out the word like this b a t bait. Do that with me. Are you ready? Here we go. B a t bait. Very good. So a i says a. All right, let's look at another vowel team that says A. We're going to spell play. P -l -a. Play. And this is also one syllable and it's a double vowel syllable. Play. Let's tap out the word play. P -l -a. Play. So it's a double vowel syllable because that a y is next to each other. Let's think about another example using our vowel teams a. Now, whenever we hear the vowel team a, if it's in the middle of a word, it is almost always going to be a i. If we hear a at the end of a word, it's almost going to be a Y. So the word that we're going to spell is train. Let's type out train. T -er -a -n. Train. Train. And I am going to spell that on my board too. So t -er -a -n. train. Now remember what I just said. If we hear a in the middle of a word and it's a vowel team, what vowel team am I going to use? Am I going to use a I or a Y? I'm going to use a I train. So when we are marking up our double syllable words, we are going to write the word. We're going to scoop the syllable. So for train, train is one syllable. It's a double vowel syllable. 
and that AI is the vowel team. So just like we circled our R controlled vowel syllables, we are going to circle our vowel team. So train. All right, so we are going to have plenty of practice this week spelling and reading words that have a I bait A and a Y play A. But now it's time for us to learn some new trick words this week. All right, so the first trick word that you see on the board is great. Oh, it sounds like it has that vowel team A, but look at the vowel team that is here. It is E-A, and usually E-A says E, but this is a trick word. It's a word we just got to know. So great is a trick word. So let's skywrite the word great. Here we go. G-R-E-A-T, great. Great. Let's write it on our arm. Here we go. G R E A T. Great. Could you use the word great in a sentence? So, usually the word great is used as a describing word. So, it was a great day today. I had a great time at school. So, great is usually a describing word. Great. Our next word is country. Country. What's the word? Country. And it sounds like we have a short uh sound, but we have an O-U. Don't forget that. That's why it's a trick word. It's a word we just got to know. Country. Let's skywrite it. C-O-U-N-T-R-Y. Country country. Let's stand up and write it with our foot. So like the hand that you write with, use the same foot. Here we go. Country. C-O-U-N-T-R-Y. Country. How could you use the word country in a sentence? I live in the country of the United States. I, the country I live in is the United States of America. How could you use the word country in a sentence? And our last trick word is a, away. Away. It has that vowel team, A, Y, play, A. And look where it's at. It's at the end. So this is the trick word, away. Let's guy write it. A, W, A, Y, away. We're going to try something a little strange. I just came up with this idea. Okay. We're going to write it with our heads. Are you ready? So we're going to make the letters with our heads. So you might want to stand up. Okay. You're going to need to bend your head down like you're writing with a pencil. Okay. And you're going to make the, sh the letter with your head. Okay. Are you ready? So let's write the word away with our head. Here we go. A- W A Y A way. Oh my goodness, that was so silly. A way. Let's look at these trick words one more time. So this word was a way, country, great. And go ahead and get your student notebook out, and we are going to write these trick words in our student notebook. So the first trick word that we're going to write is on page 67 or six tens and seven ones. And we're going to write away under the word answer. So away, A, W, A, Y, A way, away. I went far away to get some ice cream. Away. Great job. Make sure you spell that correctly and make sure you put that on page 67. Okay, that's where our trick words go. Our next word that we are going to put on here is country. Country. And we are going to write country on page 68. 
six tens and eight ones under the word carry. So we're going to put country right here. Here we go. C O U N T R Y country country. Fabulous job, Smarties. And we have one more word, and that word is great. I think of Tony the Tiger with that word. Great. And we are on page 70 or seven tens. And this is our first trick word that starts with a G. So great. G R E A T. Great. Great. All right, Smarties, you did a great job today. Remember to keep that growth mindset. Good learners do hard things. And keep your eye out for any words that have vowel teams A-I or A-Y. All right, I will see you tomorrow with another Foundations lesson. Happy learning, Smarties.